YouTube. So today I'll be talking about um, how to take care of a king sundew, Drosera regia. Um, the tag is right here, it's from Brad's Greenhouse. Ah. Yeah, Drosera regia. Get that tag back in. I'll be talking about how to grow this guy. Um, I do find it more challenging than other sundews, but there's a couple tips that you need to know in order to grow one successfully. This one is still a small plant, not not the biggest regia. And I'll get to the care. So for lighting, they need quite some bright light. Without the light, they will lose their dew droplet. If, if there's no light, they won't have any dew droplet. And I give them fluorescence and an LED grow light right here. So, and for watering, use distilled water or like any low in mineral water because in the wild, um, and also the tray method, in the wild they, they will grow in some like boggy area in South Africa and the water is very pure. And for, yeah, that's basically the, that's some little carrot tips. But the most important thing to keep your king sundew alive is feeding it. These plants are very hungry. Like, if you don't feed it, then they will struggle. Like, they actually need, they're the ones that actually need a lot of food. And here's the crown of the plant. And there's new leaves growing out of there. And you just feed them. I just feed them whenever, whenever I can. Like there's some dry blood worms on the leaf. They're all curled up right here. Um, all curled up over there. And yeah, they have nice dew droplets. Like you saw that. So I just hydrate the dried blood worms and put on their leaves and that will just help them a lot because they are really hungry if you don't feed them um, they will very they will suffer before I knew how to properly care for them I didn't really feed the, my plant and it was the the leaves were dying f faster than it was produced so that wasn't good and yeah, and they are kind of tropical. You can grow them like a tropical plant. They no, they need no winter requirements, but they do reduce their leaf sizes during the winter. And I've like during my winter, the humidity is really high, and these mosses tend to grow. And yeah, here's the king sundew care. And we'll see you on the next video. Bye. And remember to subscribe, sorry, subscribe.